What's up, party people? It's your boy, Renny Ren. And tonight, we're getting back into Soul Calibur CX. Let's see, what do I want to do today? Do I want to do some of the missions? Yeah, let's do some of the missions. Without further ado, let's do the damn things, people. Yeah, I haven't done the missions in a little while. Let's see. You wanna you wanna swing? Oh, blah, blah, blah. You wanna be careful swinging your weapon around like that by yourself. Have you maybe had a few days too many too many drinks? Barely conscious. I couldn't tell if he couldn't tell if the nightmare had ended. A shadow of what looked like an enemy wavered in front of me. One of, one of that seems robust, strong, and arms. I readied my weapon. My only escape from the nightmares was to fight. Maxi. Easy there. I'm not looking for a fight. But well, looks like I got no choice. You back to your senses? It wasn't a nightmare. I've been for, I've been fighting for real. When I came to, a friendly yet somewhat heroic looking man was standing before me. Maxi. The name is Maxi. What do you go by? I told Maxi my name. Renny Renz. Renny Ren. Nice name. <laughs> Don't worry. I ain't going to steal your, all your possessions or anything. Let's see. You know, we've got, uh, you've got skills. As an apology for attacking me out of nowhere, how about listening to what I have to say? It, it's nothing it's nothing bad just a job offer according to Maxi the residents of a nearby village suddenly vanished one day at the same time a mysterious hole formed nearby from which a strange creature has started to emerge the village the village has believed it was the creature who attacked the villagers in order they be found and execute, uh, exterminated. There we go. <laughs> I'll know, I know how to handle myself, so I agreed to help, but they wanted me to take care of them the whole 
as well as the creatures. Right when I was thinking I needed some help, I ran into you. The reward's juicier than a rare steak. How's 50-50 splitter sound? The mysterious hole sounded like a, a lot like a astro. Uh, what is that? Astro tish, fizzle, weather tissue, weather. When I asked Maxi where where it was, he pointed towards the direction I was heading. I decided to accept his offer. Alrighty then, let's do this, partner. With a self. Yeah, with a self-assured grin, he extended his hand in a spirit of solitude, solidarity. I grasped it firmly. Yeah, I know that. I know those big words, part of people. Solidarity. That's like to console, uh, like uh, something like that to console. It's a friendship. It's uh, some shit like that. <laughs> As someone traveled the world, oh yeah, yeah. As someone who had traveled the world, Maxi had a lot. Uh, <clears throat> sorry about that, party peoples. Maxi had a lot of stories to tell on our journey. All I hear nowadays is crazy talk. To the west of the continent, some lord suddenly went nuts. In other towns, there was. A massacre that wiped out an entire population, but nobody knows who or what caused it. Even we were attacked once by a bunch of creeps with red eyes. Damn. Maxi was the uh, yeah Maxi was the captain of a pirate crew who was ventured around uh, venturing around the globe. Yet he didn't speak uh, uh, speak in aggressive or threatening what, a tone. You know, I forgot to ask, what's giving you the trouble bug, Renny Ren? <laughs> Wary of saying too much, I mentioned there was something I needed to take care of in the astral, for sure, created by the evil seed. Never heard of it. Some of my crew might know something, though. I'll ask around. Man, I'm beat. Me too, Maxie. I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna turn in for the day. See you bright and early tomorrow. Oh, you're having nightmares. a splitting headache, the remnants of a nightmare flickering in my mind. What's up? You were calling out in your sleep. Here, drink up. I thanked Maxie and told him it was, it was nothing. My headache had uh, subsided, but I wasn't going to be getting any much more sleep. Suddenly, I heard a voice behind me. When I turned, there was a young man standing with a smile on his face. He gave us a small nod. Unknown stranger. Greetings. May I assume you're also heading through the forest on a mission to hunt down monsters? 
Yeah, we are. You too? Yes, my name is Horan. I heard there were the others who had accepted the, the missions, so I thought I would introduce myself. I see. I'm Maxi. This is my partner in crime, Rennie Wren. That's right, I'm partner in crime. <laughs> I have a suggestion. How about you join forces? Well, uh, while I signed up for a mission, my intent was only to save those in trouble. I have no problem in splitting the rewards with you. Sounds like a plan, but I'm going to have to test your skills first. You game? Well, of course. Let's begin. <clears throat> Eleven minutes in, party people. I know how to juggle people a little bit, party people. <laughs> Don't stand up, you might as well stay down there. <laughs> That's why I gave him a little love tap on the knee. Don't get up. <laughs> you win. I must say, your aggressive style is impressive. You have a not so bad yourself. Where'd you pick up those moves, uh, those staff skills? And Ling, uh, Ling Shang Shu, alongside my brother. To be honest, I thought I fared better against you. Nah, you didn't. You you did good. I feel it should be me asking you to join forces. <laughs> you with me, right, Randy Rand? That's right. Don't be such a downer. Fighters like this don't wash wash ashore every day. You're not one of us now. Around, welcome aboard. Thank you. A sign of your our new friendship. How about one of Ling Shang Shu's famous cakes? No one should fight on an empty stomach. Deal me in. Come on, Randy Ren, dig in. That's right. I'm, I'm, I'm there.
Stop right there. What are you doing here? We qualifiers, we qualifiers watch over these areas ahead. Those without permission to proceed will be turned away. Qualifiers. I've heard the, the, I've heard the name from some rumors going around recently. Something about saving humanity. Quit babbling and get out of here already. We're only here to hunt monsters. If we share the same mission, it would benefit us all to work together. You think I was born yesterday? You just trying to get the Astro Fisher that's Lord Aswalds. And I'll be damned if you get it. I'll be damned if you get in his way. Yeah, there we go. And that's true for sure. Isn't that the thing that you were talking about, Renny Ren? Yeah, that's right. I knew it, Daniel. These ruffians are trying to disrupt Lord as well. His plans. We should kill them before they he rides. Enraged the man readied his weapon. We don't want any trouble, just leave. It's for all it's for all our sex. You got me? Looks like they're not budging. Hey, that just means we skip to the good part. <laughs> That's right. Quit whispering. I, Valto, will slay all these who stand in Lord Aswell's way. Doing a little commentary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta get back online in here. Maybe I can fight with y'all. Bunch of suckers. That's right, I knew I won. Yeah, I think it's better we if we stand down. Valtro, let's go. Damn you to hell. Next time we meet, you won't escape my blades. Going by what they said, it would seem Lord Aswell has arrived yet. Hasn't arrived yet. Let's head over before things get uh, start to get messy. Let's go.
acquired a weapon, huh? Blah de blah de blah. Surgeon, the power surgeon from the deep for sure oppressed the entire area, swallowing up even the surrounding sounds. From Maxi, that's the hole they were talking about. Give me a break, that ain't just a hole. How troubling is certainly beyond our ability to handle. Hey partner, is that what she was talking about? Looking for? I nodded. Maxie shook his head and resigned the uh, resignus. Oh Sounds like the rumors about the monsters apparently to were true. Uh oh. What the hell? The saddlebound. With a burst of light, a warrior appeared from Astro Tazur. It let out a earth shaking roar as it readied its weapon. Berserker. <laughs> Great, I knew this wasn't going to be easy. <laughs> That's what he's saying. <laughs> Let me whoop his ass real quick. See what Mr. Berserk is gone talking about. The fallen word burst in the light that soon faded. From Maxi, well done, geez. What was that all about? From Haran, the, uh, the creature appeared to be human, but it left no trace of its existence, as though it was a phantom. I'm pretty sure the marks on my body count as a trace. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so what's the, what about the hole? Staring into the seamlessly eternal blackness, I, I thrust both of my hands into the for sure. Hey, what are you doing? From Haran, the hole just vanished. What the hell did you do? <laughs> I told Maxi and I told Maxi and Haran everything. After a long pause, Maxi gave a slight nod. Okay, yeah, from Maxi. Okay, well, I got no reason to doubt you after 
what I just saw. From Haran, agreed. I've seen some bizarre things in my life, but nothing like that. How are you feeling? From Maxi, the mission's done, so you may as well rest up for the while. I'll check to see if the road's safe. From Haran, I'll go replenish our water supply. Renny Ren. Oh, yeah. I'll go re from Haran. I'll go replenish our water supply. Renny Ren, some sweets should perk you up. Help yourself. Oh, I well, thank you. Making me hungry. Your soul surges in your body. Let's see, do I want to go any further? Yeah, might as well. I gotta, I gotta figure out how to go online and get my network back on and on. So I can find some people online, party people. <clears throat> did they did they get any new pictures? Pretty music right here. I like this music. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm gonna call it the night party, peoples. Alright, party peoples, that's the end of the gameplay. Catch you on the flip side. Later days, homies.